you uh, ever bought a puppy and a week later someone comes back and goes, oh, it's grown so much. Let's talk about those small incremental changes. The puppy dog syndrome is about the changes that you don't see. I always use the analogy about buying a dog and you buy this little thing and someone comes over and says, oh, how cute. And they go away and for that week you feed them and yeah, you muck around with them and you see them a lot. And a week later, your mate comes back and says, oh, I can't believe how much has grown in a week. And you haven't noticed it. And this is what happens when you talk about exercising or building relationships with people or doing property deals. What you end up finding out is that you're not seeing the changes, but the people around you are. So Darren, and I'll just walk here. Darren, who's behind the camera, Joel, who's running with us, he, um, he said to me the other day, geez, um, he's lost a lot of weight, hasn't he? And Darren hasn't noticed it, but the people around him are. And so when we talk about the puppy dog syndrome, it's about creating and realizing you've got small incremental changes within you that everyone else notices. And what does that do? It builds everyone else around you. Just doing this jog through the fog series, I know there's a whole series of people that have started exercising and running again, and the people around them are noticing the changes and they're wanting to see that change as well. So remember in the puppy dog syndrome that you may not see the changes, but the people around you certainly are.